Oh, it's Mike from Custom Cruises. You can see here, we've got four different types of um, heaters for grips, okay? And we've got one here for a seat. Awesome bit of kit as well. All made, well, that these two here and here are made by heat demons, okay? So they keep your hands warm and your ass warm, all right? This particular setup, this basically goes inside your bar. Now, you do have to drill the bar, okay? So you've got to drill a small hole for this wire to come out the bar, and you run these down the down with your cables okay you then got a controller here you press this on or off all right and this heats the bar which heats the grips draws less than four amps <clears throat> um 40 watts less than three amps is absolute bullshit because if you work it out 40 watts at 12 volts is about three and a half amps okay so i don't know where they're getting their math from but it obviously draws less than three amps because it's 40 watts led heat indicator will tell you how hot the thing is you know, it's got different um, colours on here, all right? <clears throat> Very cool bit of kit. Now, Old Faithful that I use on a lot of my bikes, especially the cruisers, the Taurus, okay? You can use them on a cruiser um, in one inch, and then you just need a grip cover. You know, put a nice, decent leather-covered lace-up thing on it or something. But this, two two heats. Look, in these ran about 55 quid. These ones around about 130 to 150, depending who you buy it off. OK, but these are very good, very cheap, very easy to fit as well. No drilling. Just run the wires down the bars. OK, and just leave a bit of a loop for your throttle to allow it to uh, twizzle. OK, another type of heater grip is this. This is your Goldwing grip. OK, this one here. Basically, what you're going to do is you're going to put a heated very thin film on here and slide the grip over the top all right now you can see here this is the thing you're going to put on you got one for the throttle it's very very thin and basically that is going to go right under your grip and heat it this again you take your clamp off your handlebars this thing then has leds built in okay and here there's all leds like you can see on the picture or possibly you can and you can control the heat so you've got three or four different ranges of heat with this particular thing for a goldwing OK, your Harley boys and some of your Japs as well. Same sort of thing again. Avon, very good quality again. These grips, by the way, they're going to run you around about 135. We have got them on offer on closeout. I think they're about 110, um, the full kit, which is less than the wholesale to buy in. Now, these are some of the coolest grips. Avon, OK. Avon, this is a Harley set. <clears throat> you basically take your... Um, you clutch your throttle perch or clutch perch. What's that one? Right, that is the throttle side, okay? So you're going to take your throttle thing off and then you've got high and low on there and off, all right? This replaces it. So the back of your brake master cylinder, this will replace. You've then got the heater wires come out the, out the middle. So like these, you do have to drill the bar, small hole. This comes out, goes down the hole, a lot of the Harley bars, if you're changing your bars, fit some decent bars on it, they will be drilled in anyway. But uh, if not, you're going to have to drill a small hole, OK? And then this particular one, this has got the throttle boss on, as they call it, which you can adjust this. So basically, when you're doing... If I can hold the thing, show you. When you're doing 70 mile an hour, this thing will be under your hand, OK? So the idea is, as you're going along, you set, you undo the end of the grip, and then you can set this thing to whatever 70 mile an hour is, okay? But um, it's not a bad idea in all honesty, and we do want to match the other side if you want, we can just take it off. But uh, available with or without that. These grips are not cheap. They are very, very good quality, but you are looking around about 250, 300 quid a set. Also in black and various other colors, but uh, at least that's your options. The other option you got as well, heat your ass, okay? This thing here, beautiful bit of kit. It's just a simple pad you put on. It's got a dual heat controller with it as well. Like it says, never eye cold. Okay, very good. You Velcro this. Sorry, you, you double side tape this. It comes with it. Stick this onto your seat. You run the wire under the seat. All right. And then basically you connect it up to a controller. Um, and as you can see, there's a controller for the... Um... Sorry, this... Where is it? Yeah, this one here, right, okay. So you get a, sw a switch here, okay? 
and this is your dual heat thing or you can get the single on and off but this is the high and low kit then obviously you can get a dual kit as well now these fits any vehicle with a battery it will also fit a car seat in all honesty it's a carbon fiber seat heater with durable foam 30 watts per seat heater each seat can't do the math says under 12 amp 33 amps which is rubbish because oh 30 watts yeah that's right the other one's wrong it says 40 amps 40 watts, which is over 3 amps, 312s are 36 by my reckoning. Okay, very good quality gear. And as you know, custom cruisers don't sell shit. Okay, we do. Here's the old bar jobber for your bike, if you want to hear the sound. Awesome bit of kit. We do Held. Um, we do Simpson. We do Tuzo. Tuzo, not a bad make, in all honesty. Sounds cheap, but they're very good. And also we do Sir Q, which is Ledry. Here's Tuzo again. Tuzo do some pretty cool stuff for the summer or this particular jacket, 75 quid. This will do all year. You've got the vented. You've then got inside a warm liner and you've got a waterproof liner as well. Um, very good gear. This one here is a held jacket. Very cool as well. And these are the held pack lights, as they call them. Really screw up small, shove them in your back. Uh, literally in your back pocket on your bike jacket or you stick them in your bag or whatever. But uh, shock upgrades as well, as you can see. We've got masses of shop upgrades, crazy Harley exhaust there. More helmets, built while lane splitters, etc. We've got bells, you know, masses of helmets. Biker glasses, which are essential if it's cold. Otherwise, your eyes will freeze up. Battery chargers, audio for the bike. Again, bike speakers as opposed to the soundbar. We've got loads of helmets again, Simpson, Scorpion. One half inch bars, back to helmet liner refresher. Good idea. I'll be honest, you might laugh, but your helmets do get shitty and smelly. I personally use one of the uh, helmet liners. It's like a silk thing or shamper in the winter, and that keeps you warm. Okay, keeps you very warm. Then we've got all your other helmets. We've got luggage. We've got seats. Okay, it's a mess due to COVID. Well, that's what I'm saying anyway. Um, we've got ladies jackets very cool these are from the states biker jackets lots of room in them these are the gun vest pockets two of them get your hand right in <coughs> lots of room okay we've got all your leather bags if you want to go touring free tea and coffee when the covid ends if you want to come up and like i say just you name it we do it it is a mess at the moment but unfortunately with the covid we've got to pack everything in here as well so uh, we've got batteries motor bat and we do the proper Yuasa, and we also do Odyssey, which are unbelievable. 500 cranking amps for a small battery for a Harley. Turn anything over, even my Sprinter. But uh, billet wheels, race bikes, and cruisers as well. Not just uh, cruisers. We've got billet pulleys. We've got brake discs upstairs as well as these. You know, we've got floaters. We've got normal. We've got Harrisons. We've got Harley engines. Um, better brakes, God knows you need them on a Harley as anyone who's ridden one will know unless you've got a brand new one with a Brembo we've got offset kits for the Harleys if you want to kick the uh, kick it out to put a bigger wheel, air suspension compressors 2.4 kilowatt starters monsters silicon dot 5 and I say loads of grips and loads of parts ok, if you're interested give us a call 01773835666 alternatively customcruisers.com the new site, customcruisers.eu, also good. Give us a call. Stay safe. Thank you.